Hello, my name is Lisa Robin Deutsch, and I go by Lisa Love. Today is February 29th, leap year 2024, the day a woman can propose in Ireland, which I did to the last man I truly fell in love with, but I'm still single. I'm from New York City, but mainly grew up in a beautiful organic town outside of the city called Hastings on the Hudson. I have two amazing parents, Matthew and Susan Deutsch, and two lovely brothers, Jack and Eric. I went to Syracuse University and studied advertising design and photography. I worked in Manhattan, then moved to Los Angeles and got into Hollywood business as a designer and set decorator in film, TV, and commercials. I then created my own company called Soulful Design. Originally photography-based, now painting, mixed media, and collage. I have two incredible kids, Hunter, 23 now, and Jade, 19, who inspire me always. I do art, murals, wallpaper, all with the meaning of love, peace, hope, inspiration. I'm feeling this energy through color, words, hearts, and nature. After losing my dad, Matthew, 14 years ago, this is how we said we would speak through hearts, rainbows, words, as I was living in Maui, Hawaii at that time. Love is truly my mission. My Hollywood background enables me to be a true visionary of self-expression. I grew up in New York, in Manhattan, with museums and visiting galleries and fashion, which also inspired me. Texture, style, patterns, self-expression, colors, always seeing the world through beauty. My biggest influences are my parents. They taught me true love, strength, culture, determination, and self-expression. Also, I found yoga and meditation as I taught, and my yoga mentor, Brian Kess, gave me the teaching of gratitude, practice, and health and wellness, which today is still a big part of my life. Very grateful for this platform and to share my art. And mainly, the loves of my life, my two children. There is no greater love than them as I bring them into this world sharing compassion, self-awareness, and love. I also love Philippe Stark, the French designer, his white, Simplistic beauty always touched my heart. I am living now the last four months in Bali, Indonesia. As my last child, Jade, went off to college in Paris, I decided to pack up my life and come here with two suitcases or three. A uh, big change with my heart, knowing it was time to explore and self-express a new life. I've wanted to explore this island, the spirituality of the people, the landscape, and the colorful life it is. I've been painting watercolors, mixed media, acrylic, and lots of heartfelt moments of a new life. Taking my art worldly, meeting new friends from around the world, traveling to express my heart in all its phases. Very grateful for this island and for these times of self-healing and of seeing each, seeing hearts all on the island. 
The biggest challenge of being an artist has been for me to call myself an artist. I think I'm finally there and truly to get acknowledged as one. I'm a healing sacred artist sharing this with the world, knowing the world sees me and feels my energy of love, passion, vulnerability, inspiration, peace, and beauty. The advice I'd give my younger self, love yourself along the way, be you, explore, self-express. There is no failures. Do your passion and the money will flow. Take chances, talk to strangers, connect from the heart. No many doors will close and open for a new path and experiences. Leap and the net will appear. We only have one life to live and every breath is a blessing. Love deeper, open your heart. I love you. I think one of the most exciting mediums has been seeing my art as wallpaper. And I also did an amazing mural in the town I lived in for 14 years, Malibu, California, which has my heart forever. And I also lived in Aspen, Colorado and Maui, Hawaii. I did it a beautiful collage piece before I left Malibu, which was my ode to my town from surf to blue, words, poetry. Uh, it was really my first collage piece and uh, sold to one of my favorite collectors, Miss Karen. My latest work uh, in Bali has been through self-expression with color, the gold of painting of the temples that they do here in this big jar of gold has really turned me on and the metallic pinks and I painted over hundreds of hearts on the last canvas for Valentine's Day and my work is really also about hearts. I also love doing intuitive paintings with clients as I teach and share meditation and hear their words of wisdom as I listen to their heart. I love to do art while playing love songs. I've been a huge Michael Jackson, Lenny Kravitz, Luther Vandross, Babyface, John Mayer, John Legend, and the list goes on. When I shoot my photography, it's usually the outdoor beauty of light and feelings of nature. Some of the reactions to my artwork. I used to do boutique hotel design shows in New York and Vegas. I had a booth with a friend and displayed a huge wall with my wallpaper printed in silver. The images were of love, peace, hearts, and inspiration. And a man who owned many hotels came over and stopped and totally took in my heart of self-expression and stared at the wallpaper. He said, this is amazing and incredible. Whatever you do, please, please don't ever stop sharing your art and designs. It was very powerful and I will never forget that. I also created art shows with music venues from friends who were amazing musicians. And I would watch people just stop in front of my art and feel it and smile and be happy. Art makes people feel emotions. I'm so grateful for my gift from my heart as it heals others too. I also shared my company, Soulful Design, at my son's class when he was younger at his school in Malibu as I came there for career day. 
the children wrote thank you cards to me, and it touched my heart how they were seeing the world differently through love and hearts and beauty. I hope people feel good when they see my artwork at shows and in their homes and in their offices and spas and where I sold my work, that they see life from the heart and beauty within and all around them, that they want to create a happier, healthier, more loving life, that they love deeper and connect with the world and are more at peace and more grateful. I thank you very much from my heart for this platform on Instagram and for the owner of this beautiful platform as other artists share who they are in the world. So this is Lisa Love coming to you from Bali and living in a lot of beautiful places. You can find me at Only Positive on Instagram. And you could also find me on Instagram at goddess.of.divine.love. So grateful. Thank you.